Hey everybody, looks like there is a new update for my Model 3, and this will be the first time that I'll be updating it while on Wi-Fi. So let's see how long this takes and what the new update is. See y'all in a few. Hey everybody, just got finished downloading the latest update, 2018.32.2. And we go into the what's new in this update. All it's telling me here is this release contains minor improvements and bug fixes. And then goes into the previous release notes. So I was doing a little digging here. And here are the few things that I found so far. If you know of anything else, please leave it in the comment section below. But here is what I have picked up and for what I believe to be in this latest update. Um, the first one is in this, this upper left hand corner here. I now have the fog lights and the lights on opposite sides of each other on the left hand driver panel. Um, another thing that I found while going through uh, was in the lock section under controls, it now tells you what phone is active in the car. Another one I found was under light. The auto high beams are now there uh, as a function that you can control within the control panel. Uh, so those are the only things that I've seen here. Uh, again, I'm not sure if this may have been part of the last update. I don't think so. I typically do a pretty good job of digging through and seeing if there's anything new. Uh, so these are the ones that I believe to be part of this latest update. If there's anything you know of different, please leave it in that comment section below. Hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And please subscribe. I'm having uh, a lot of videos come up here in the near future that will be a little bit different. Uh, first few videos I'm going to be doing are going over uh, wash technique of my Tesla Model 3 trying to really take care of this car uh, you may be like me out there wanting to keep this car for a while uh, and so I'm really trying to do everything that I can to protect this car uh, so I've really researched and gone into uh, proper wash techniques uh, and way to treat the car as I've told you in past videos I'm not going with the ceramic coating I will be doing a full video on what I'm doing but I'm going to start with a little bit of a series. So I'm going to go over the tires, uh, wheels and tires first. Uh, washing the car, drying the car, different things like that. And then I will have a video on a full decontamination of the car. Uh, wiping everything, all the waxes, all the iron that may be on the car. Basically wiping the slate as clean as possible getting back to uh, as fresh of paint as possible and then going with uh, the choice that I went with in protecting the car which is not a ceramic coating. Um, if you do go the ceramic coat route, make sure you go with the professional or you really know what you're doing uh, getting the car to that prep phase because it takes a lot. Uh, so I'll be going over a lot of those techniques here. And then the other thing I'm going to be doing with this channel is I'm currently under renovation of my home. And so I'm looking to be greener in my everyday life. So I'm looking into solar currently. Uh, I'm changing some things around the house that trying to make it a little bit more efficient. So I want to show uh, what I have been researching and what I've been going with. And so I'm going to try to take you guys along uh, with me on that ride. So if that's something that interests you, please hit that subscribe button and tap that bell to be notified with the next video. And uh, let's get this show on the road and uh, see how this journey goes and where it takes us. So until the next time, be well and I will talk to you guys later.